You lying snake. How could you? Well, there's gratitude. Not you, him! Who? Him! What? If you think that this is some kind of a joke, I will kill you myself. It was a lovely service, wasn't it? You could have shown a little bit more compassion for the rest of the family. But I must admit, I really appreciate the sincere grief that you showed for me. And I want you to know that I love you too, Tracy. How can you do this to us? You think I faked my death? You would do something like that. Well, yes, I pretended to be dead when Luke poisoned me. I'm going to have to think of a few tricks to convince you that this is real. Maybe I could drop a sheet over my head and go, woo, woo, woo. Oh, Alan, that's not funny. Tracy, Alan is dead, honey. People made speeches. You're talking to an empty chair. That's not funny either. Tracy, you were in the hospital when Alan died. Now look, maybe you should lie down for a while. Grief can do terrible things to the mind. You think I'm imagining him? Well, I guess that can only mean one thing. You need medication. You and Alan are in on this together. Careful, Tracy. That stuff will kill you. What are you doing? I'm haunting you. Oh, ha ha. I don't believe in ghosts. You think you're hallucinating? Alan, how can you live with yourself? You let us all say such nice things about you. The nerve of me dying. Alan, you didn't die. You're faking your death. I can see you. I can touch you. You think so? Go ahead, give it a shot. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Whoa! How'd you do that? Why are you here? You forged my will. Alan, you gave three quarters of your estate to Jason's children just in case maybe he should decide to have them. How stupid is that? Whoa! Did you do that too? I understand that happens when you argue with the dead. Other than that, it's a very pleasant place to be in the afterlife, and thank you for asking. So, have you seen Mother yet? No, I, I can't yet, because I cannot yet rest in peace. I'm kind of stuck halfway, and I can't get my entry permit until you admit that you forged my will. <laughs> Why would I admit something you already know? Not to me, to the whole family. Now I know it's a setup. You and Daddy cooked this whole thing up together with Dylan's help with his, his, his filmmaking kit. You're going to torture me until I give up what should have been mine in the first place. There's video equipment here, I know it. And it's not going to work. Who are you yelling at? Him! Him whom? He was just here. You don't look so good, Miss Tracy. Maybe you should lie down. I'm fine. Have this place fumigated. Yes, ma'am. <laughs>